to me here. Strong is doing. Strong's doing something upstairs right now. Probably playing piano. Anyways, as you probably heard a week ago, some thanks to a low humidity, hot, uh, lots of wind, and very hot temperatures, fires started in Alberta. They spread a lot, and then and and it didn't spread, but then fires started in other places too, including Nova Scotia, Quebec, and Northern Ontario. About like. Two hour, a two hour drive from Toronto, without traffic, by the way. Yeah, like uh, the for like for like a brief period of time, about three three to four days, there was like fires all over, and in here you could smell the smoke. Like imagine a blue sky, but for some reason the blue was like a tint of smoke. And like for the first day of the Alberta wildfire, and for like the first day of the world, Alberta wildfire, it only smelled a tint like, it only smelled a tint like a fire. But then in the days following, for some reason it smelled like a campfire was right next to you. These fires went on, but, but then about five days after, some rain came along and washed it. For some reason, thanks to winds blowing, uh, all of the smoke that was that was from the Quebec wildfires and the others have now been blown on the U.S. We don't have to worry about them anymore. They have to now. Now, now the fires are are mostly over. Although although there are some reports of fires still in Alberta, most in Quebec and Northern Ontario and and some in Nova Scotia have been drowned out by the by the by the rain. No. Ev evacuees who who had to evacuate their their homes in Quebec because of the fires are now coming back. So that's all you need to know about the Canadian wildfires. Anyways, if you'd like, here's a garden. My dad decided to build a fence around it so that rabbits wouldn't come in and start eating the plants. They 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 like they like tomato plants for some reason. Uh, oh yeah, and over here you can see the garlic plants. And uh, and if you're wondering why we didn't build the fence around these, it's because the rabbits don't really like it. Oh yeah, there's rabbits now. Every time we have to leave for some class or something, every time we come back, there's like two rabbits trying to eat the gra eating the grass. But they all run away when they see us. There used to be a, like three, I remember, but I, I don't remember what happened to the third one. But now there's only two. So uh, yeah, that that's an update. And uh, thanks, thanks for checking.